Well, tonight, a new push for parents to talk to their kids and other parents about gun safety before sending them into someone else's home. This new report follows a story you saw here on NBC Charlotte where horrified parents saw their children find guns and then point them at other kids and at themselves. NBC Charlotte's Xavier Walton has the story. This summer, before your kids go to a friend's house, officials say there are a few questions that you really need to ask your kids. School is out, but doctors say there's a lesson for parents to teach their kids. Parents ask each other whether or not they have guns that are not locked up in their homes before sending their children to play. That's the big push from the American Academy of Pediatrics. Maybe uncomfortable, but I think um, it's conversations that we need. The CDC says each day 78 children are injured or killed in America by a gun. ADW with injury. Shot. That shocking number includes Charlotte. A few months back, a 10-year-old was shot accidentally by a teenager. 10-year-old male shot, car advised that she does not know what happened. A doctor in Texas so concerned, he started a program that gives parents a first-hand look at how their child would react if they found a firearm. What? Man, he just looked down the barrel of the gun like we have totally said not to do that. The guns used for testing are unloaded, but in real life, that's not always the case. In North Carolina, 51 kids were killed with a gun in 2016, 97 hospitalized, and there were at least 314 that went to the emergency room. Karen Fisher, a gun expert and safety instructor, believes teaching kids explicitly through hands-on training will lower accidents and deaths. Got it. Mm -hmm. One in three households in America have a gun. You may never have one, but that does not mean that your child's not going to go three doors down and be in a home with a gun. I'm Xavier Walton for NBC Charlotte. New video.